Hello guys, welcome to another NASCAR diecast reviews today. Today I'm going to be reviewing five different diecasts I got here today. Well, six actually, but turns out it was a diecast I already have, which was a Red Moffat. So I got that today. Uh, the Red Moffat diecast that I currently have, I'm making into a custom Sam Mayer diecast. So. So yeah, but anyways, these diecasts were from the were for the gifts that I got today. So thanks to everyone who got me those to my family. So yeah, I got Ben Rhodes' 2022 truck diecast, Landing Castles 2022 Xfinity car, and then two My Common Racing cards, which which is of. Kyle Weatherman's 2020 car and Bailey Curry's 2021 car. So, and a 124 scale version of Dale Jr.'s 2021 Xfinity car. Um, I actually already have the 164 version already. So, yeah, but I didn't have the 124 scale. So, I think I'll start off with. This diecast first. Uh, this is an adult collectible. So I'll put it back in the box once I'm done. So you got Xfinity Mobile 1 A ARP. Camaro Front End Junior Motorsports Noco Fuel. Uh, it, the hood does open. I'll give you guys a shot of the engine. Yeah, I kind of uh, messed around with the hood a bit, so won't well, close good. Oh well. And then you got Xfinity Dale Jr. Dale Jr. there on the the on the windshield. Exalta got the American flag there. Dale Jr. signature. All your sponsors right here. Get a look at the inside. And uh, you also have where the winches go in to make it loose or tight. So that's pretty cool. A lot of detail. Oh uh, yeah, that's uh, Dale Jr.'s uh, Xfinity car from 2021. Didn't really bother to review it that much since, well, I already have the 120, the 164 scale of it. So now let's go ahead and review the other diecast. I'll start off with Kyle Weatherman's car. Now this is this was quite f strange whenever I opened this diecast up, but I noticed that the front end and the back end of the car are the, is the uh, back end and front end of the 2017 Camaro. So yeah, this is the same front end and back end as the uh, 2017 version of the Camaro in the Xfinity series, so. But hey, it looks pretty cool. And I think in the reason why is because I think Mike Harmon Racing was like an underfunded team. So they just used the, 2020, uh, the 2017 Camaro until they raised enough money for the 2019 Camaro. Yeah. Okay, but anyways, you got the front end here, 47. You got an American flag there. Uh, this was uh, Kyle Weatherman's scheme for the Charlotte race for Xfinity back in 2020. So you got Kyle Weatherman, Xfinity Series, Goodyear, 47. Hashtag back the blue. Got a little bit of patriotic American flag colors there on the bottom of the car. Uh, some sort of sponsor there on the deck lid. Kurt Weatherman there. Xfinity. 
Hashtag back the blue Camaro fake pair of, fake pair of exhaust. And it is in all black with a little bit of with a blue stripe along with the American flag and the American flag colors paint scheme. You look at the bottom. This was made on the 310th day of 2020 on the EL mode. So made in China, Lionel Racing 2020 Camaro. I'm starting to think it's 2018 considering the front end. <laughs> Alright, next I'll review Bailey Curry's car. So this is also a Mike Harming racing car for the Xfinity series. So you got the Camaro front end, Mike Harming racing. I uh, thought there would be a 74, but I guess not. Uh, running for heroes is the scheme. Okay, you got 74. Got a bun bunch of uh, sponsors there. I think those are like badges though, or something. They got it on the uh, decolade too, and on the back. Gresco, uh, Camaro. It is a black and gray with blue and red stripe paint scheme. Look at the bottom. This was made on the 322nd day of 2021. So line all racing made in China, 2021 Camaro. So these two guys, uh, Weatherman and Curry, Curry, I believe they still race in the Xfinity series right now. Uh, Weatherman, as I mentioned before in another video, uh, was subbing in for Blaine Perkins. So, yeah, and then Bailey Curley, C Curry, she's I keep pronouncing that last name wrong. But yeah, I think Bailey Curry, I don't, I don't know if he still races or not. So you guys will have to let me know. All right, next, uh, Landing Castles, uh, Voyager Camaro. So let's go ahead and review that. So 10, Colleague Racing, Sunoco Racing Fuel, Crypto for All. Here you got NASCAR Xfinity Series, 10, Voyager, Got your sponsors there, Leaf Filter, Castle, Warrior Go there, get a look at the other side, and the back. It is a purple and a little bit of white paint scheme. Get a look at the bottom. This was made on the 168th day. Or is that 188th day? It's kind of hard to tell. I think it says 188th day of 2022 on the EL mode. So Lane and Castle. I uh, believe he started in Cup. Or Xfinity. I'm not sure. But yeah. He raced in Cup for quite some time. And Xfinity... Uh, he actually ran some part-time races in 2022 for the Cup Series. And, yeah, he didn't return this season, so I'm thinking he's retired from racing. I'm not sure. But, yeah, he no longer races for a colleague in the 10. The 10 is, uh... Now a full-time car with part-time drivers. So that's what it is. So yeah. Now, last but not least, Ben Rhodes' 2022 Toyota Tundra sponsored by Kabo Kabuda. 
So we got the all new 2022 Tundra front end. Got the 99 Thor Motorsports, or at least that what it would say. Got Kabuda, Camping Mode. And this is actually a playoff truck, as you can see right there. Oh, come on. The cameras can get really blurry. Whenever I zoom in too close. But it does say round of 10 along with NASCAR Camping World Trucks Series Playoffs. Got a bunch of sponsors here. Uh... Tender, Kabuda, uh, Ben Welds there on the back, Toyota Kabuda Orange Rental, got the back end, Thor Sport Toyota, 99. Uh, this was made on the 47th day of 2023 on the EL mode. So we got Toyota Tundra used on the license, Lionel Racing, made in China. Now, I saw a uh, Brian Griffin fan uh, post earlier today. Uh, said something about a sponsor that belonged to Ryan Sieg. So that is quite interesting to hear. Uh, ben Rhodes... Uh, I believe he started his career in trucks. Uh, he still currently races for the truck series, driving the 99 for Thor Sport. Uh, my mom hap happens to be a fan of Ben Rhodes. So yeah, I uh, believe he made some part-time starts in Xfinity and Cup, I think. But I'm not sure. And it is an all orange paint scheme with some black stripe design. And a little bit of black in the back with the window banner and spoiler blue. So, yeah, those were my gifts that I got for my birthday. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. And be sure to leave a like and comment down below. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And yeah, that's just about it. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.